Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to look into how does the GCP organization onboarding looks like for cyber secure cloud access solution. So here I'm going to click on onboard your cloud workspace. So it, it is going to redirect us to the cloud entitlement management page. So here I'm going to click on setup platform management. We are going to select GCP. So we are we want to onboard entire GCP organization. I'll select add new organization. And then we have to provide a bunch of these details. The first detail it is asking about the organization ID. So I'm going, going to go to my GCP. So here, this is my GCP organization ID. I'm going to copy and paste there. And in terms of uh, the data set, I don't have existing data set. So I want CM to create a centralized data set to collect all the logs information. So I'm going to select my uh, test project. So let me copy my test project ID. So these are the two things what we have to provide. And then we have to open the Google Cloud Shell. So let me see whether it is choosing my correct account or not. So sales at the rate of sesolutionsdemo.com is my correct account. So we are account now so what i'll do i'll create a lab so this is my radiant fly so we are going to copy all the scripts so let's copy all the scripts and then once i do ls so you are you can see there are like a bunch of script we are going to execute and then let's try running this deploy command so it is creating a cm resources so i will enable the apis This entire deployment takes uh, three to four minutes of time. So let's wait. So now it is assigning the permissions. Then it's creating a custom CM role. It is, it is assigning that custom role to the CM service account. Then it is assigning a bunch of other permissions. So this is my CM service account value. So I'm gonna copy this.
So then pending part is we have to copy the SCA service account value as well. So I'm going to go to the cloud shell. So it is it has created a service account for SCA and now it is assigning a bunch of permissions. So now this entire script uh, execution has completed successfully. So what we will do, we will go to the platform console, deploy program manager deployments. And then we are trying to get this SCA service account value. So I'm going to go to my test project. So we are going to go to the deployment manager. So this, these are the two service account got created. So we are going to copy the final value of SCA. So it is saying click on layout, then copy this entire value. So what I'll do, I'll download the script. So this is the entire thing. So I'm gonna copy the final value. And then I'll go to my cloud in title by management. So we have pasted both CM and SCA value. As a last step, what we have to do, we have to go to the GCP console and we have to select the CM service account email ID. So I'm going to go to this project. We are going to go to IAM, then service accounts. So we are going to copy this. service account email ID. So now we have copied the service account email ID. So now we have to log in into the Google workspace. And for the group reader role, we have to assign a admin role for this CM service account. So I'm gonna to go to my admin console. We are gonna to go to account, admin roles, group readers, and then um, then I have to assign the member. We are going to add our service account, then assign a role. Role assignment looks to have been done. Ah, okay. So we should have selected assigned service account. So that was the mistake I was making. Now we will assign the service account. And that's the group's reader. And that's pretty much about the onboarding. Now let's click on start discovery. So I will refresh. So 
So there are two projects discovered. Let's click on connect button. So now both the projects is showing connected and uh, CM solution will start analyzing all the different roles and users and the groups present in the in the Google organization and the Google workspace. And so that's pretty much in terms of the Google organization onboarding onto Cyberarc CM or Cyberarc Secure Cloud Access Solution. So thanks a lot, everyone, for watching this short video. Talk to you guys next time.